Hey guys, what is up? Fluffy Ninja from FN13 Productions, and welcome to this video, I guess. Um, yeah, I should probably work on getting an intro. But anyway, I have an unboxing video of this. So, uh, I already opened it, of course, because I was super excited to get it. Uh, posted a picture on Instagram, so if you're not following me on Instagram, definitely do that. Uh, because you get to see all the things that I, that I acquire. So this is from Typhoon Tactical, and it is the Spider Hammer 7 Straight ASA. Uh, I was actually super excited to see this when it came out because the Hammer 7 in itself, oh, damn it, the Hammer 7 in itself is an awesome gun. It really is. It's a great intro to pump. It's a great intro to mag fed. It's a great intro to limited ammo. It's you know, it's a great intro to first strike and to milsim and to all the other things. And honestly, it is just a, a really cool looking gun, honestly. And some of the things that people have done to it are just astounding. Like, seriously, like somebody, uh, well, like the most common thing is I keep seeing it put in uh, M24 rifle stocks. And it looks incredible. I know there's a, a video on YouTube that if you just look up Hammer 7 mods, it's like the first, the first video and he's got two of them. It's... Uh, like, it's just him showing off his Hammer 7 in, uh, like, a Remington 700 stock or an M24 stock. Or I, I forget what stock it is. But it just looks incredible. Like, it's, it's, like, that's what the Hammer 7 was made for. Like, there aren't really paintball sniper rifles, which, you know, is disappointing. I mean, the dam is okay. Uh, like, Pistol Pete does a bunch of sniping videos with his. The SAR-12 is probably the closest thing that you'll get. I know CCM's making something relatively like it. The DMR from RAP4 is crap. Pretty much every RAP4 gun is crap. Basically, if it uses first strike rounds, it's a sniper rifle. Uh, so, you know, there's that. You know, like if, like, but there's not really a bolt action except for the, the SAR-12. And not everybody I know that wants to play sniper has $1,400 down their pants. A couple guys that I know do, uh, that's for sure. But, you know, it's one of those things that to to get the result you don't have to spend that much money uh so the hammer 7 is definitely an excellent choice you get uh 20 inch barrel maybe which i'm going to be picking up pretty soon or an 18 inch i think uh you can put a, a stock around it which you can get off of ebay for like 30 bucks but it, we're, we're here to talk about this the, i'm not sure what these two screws are I, obviously they're for the body to keep it in place uh i don't have my hammer 7 with me Unfortunately, it's in my gear bag, which is still down in at my aunt's house So I do have to go get that tomorrow, and then I will probably do a video installing it But honestly, it's just a beautifully machined piece of aluminum. Um, I noticed that they didn't sign it Which is kind of weird like there's no logo on it that says Typhoon Tactical and you'd think the company that made this would do that I mean the packaging Super simple. It's a little expensive for a piece of aluminum that's been machined quite nicely. I'm not gonna lie It's a beautifully machined piece of aluminum and two screws But you get a little plastic bag that says Typhoon Tactical what it is the website that you got it from uh, Then you get like a plain yellow envelope and that's it and like it surprisingly it didn't take that long to get here I think I ordered it last uh, I don't know, I want to say Monday, I want to, uh, yeah, I think I ordered it either Monday or Tuesday. It was $47 with shipping, but that's because it was going through customs and coming from Canada. So yeah, this is a Canadian product, but it's, it's definitely, like, it, it, hopefully it holds up, I'm not going to lie. Um, but yeah, the, like, what I'm going to do with my Hammer 7, I already have the bolt action knob, uh, I might take that a little bit further, uh, I'm getting... An 18 inch or a 20 inch barrel just because uh, it's going to be mag fed only with first strikes hopefully I can hook up a scope cam and we can get that going because why not I have an iPhone 4 around here somewhere that I don't use that I can probably use for the scope cam just because like the level of the replay and the level of the scope is off by like that much it's like literally like just crossing swords just barely but uh like it's not docking which is unfortunate so you know um but yeah you know like i have a, a regulator here just to see 
just the fit, I guess. This is a very shitty regulator, even though it's a Ninja Pro rig, it's still a piece of shit. I hate these. Oh man, that, wow, that's gorgeous. Really, really smooth kind of feel to it. Unfortunately, like, I'm not just going to be doing regulator to uh, back block here. I have the on-off ASA from uh, Tiberius that I have. Uh, I'm going to be putting that into here and then the tank into here. That way it's a little bit of a longer, longer stock, longer reach. And honestly, uh, I it's it's probably going to be like the first project gun that I actually do and complete and you know make look cool and function uh, nicely. So I'm I'm am actually really excited about that because I have all this time off now. I need something to do. So I th I thought you know what I'm going to make my Hammer Seven a goddamn sniper rifle. So this is step numero uno is getting the straight ASA. So thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. If you're a subscriber, if you're not a subscriber, do it. Um, if we hit 500 subscribers by the end of summer, I'm giving away uh, in E-Tech 5, I think is what I said. I don't remember. Let me know in the comments below if I said E-Tech 5. So yeah. Um, yeah, we're definitely going to be... Uh, I'm sorry, a message dropped down for me real quick from uh, from Grim, so I, I was reading that. But, um, yeah, you know, so this is a straight ASA from Typhoon Tactical. I will do an ins installation video. I will do, like, a first kind of, like, look at the sniper rifle Hammer 7. So, yeah, thank you guys very much for watching, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.